Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the University of Maryland University College. We're so proud to have all of you here on uh, our campus, and, uh, uh, and I look forward to working with all of you today and uh, uh, discussing this such an important topic in the United States and in the state of Maryland. Maryland has been a leader in many ways uh, for years, uh, not only in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, uh, and so it's no surprise that we would have a symposium on such an important topic here today. Uh, I'm proud to have you on this campus because UMUC uh, is a campus that's very concerned about STEM initiatives, uh, creating new teachers and opportunities for training teachers in the future. Many of you know in the last week there was uh, uh, news coverage nationally about an anonymous donor who has donated millions of dollars, and we're so proud that the University of Maryland University College was a $6 million recipient from a truly anonymous donor. Thank you for that. And uh, we, we didn't call the FBI or anything, but uh, uh, we did, we did uh, drill the banker about uh, whether or not this was a, a legitimate donation. And, and sure enough, within two days, uh, the checks arrived. Well, the reason I'm saying that to you is not only because we're proud of that, and it's our largest single donation here at the university, but we are taking some of those dollars and we're putting them into scholarships for uh, Maryland residents who want to uh, come into our Master of Arts and teacher pro teaching program, particularly to specialize in STEM areas. And so we've, we've started with a half a million dollars that we hope to allocate for scholarships this summer. We will add more to that in the fall as we have more individuals who want to come into this arena. So our institution is committed to help in this critical workforce shortage area in the state of Maryland, and I look forward to working with all of you as together uh, we try to lead in this initiative uh, in the United States, and particularly at home where our schools and our students need these teachers in the schools. I want to say a special thanks to the system for offering this opportunity for all of us today, I want to welcome all of our distinguished guests. And for those of you that uh, are joining us for the very first time at UMUC, I'll just give you two sentences about UMUC. For 62 years, we've been the campus in the Maryland system that has served working professionals. Uh, we are now today the largest state university in the United States with 94,000 students. We have 157 teaching locations where we teach face-to-face -face classes. About 24 of those locations are here in the state of Maryland, and the rest of them are in 26 countries around the world. As a state university, we have the largest online program as well. So we look forward to serving future teachers in, uh, in the state of Maryland, both online and in a face-to-face -face environment. Uh, and again, I want to say a special welcome to all of you uh, for this great, great day and a great opportunity for Maryland. It's now my distinct pleasure to introduce my boss, uh, the Chancellor of the University System of Maryland, uh, Dr. William Brick Kerwin. <laughs> 